Hey, my name's Richard Hajeki. I'm captain of the Yankee Troller, and I run Crazy Yankee Sport Fishing. So every spring we start out in the Port of Rochester. Uh, the Port of Rochester has some of the most consistent brown trout fishing year in and year out due to the amount of inflow in that basin of the lake. There's no shortage of colored water in Rochester, so you can always find that water that the brown trout are hanging in, and it makes the bite a little bit easier. Around the end of April, we typically leave Rochester and head down to Niagara County, and we'll spend about a month, typically about the weekend after Memorial Day, there's a, uh, there's a pro-am in Niagara County, and then we will head back to what we call our summer port. Our summer port is Oak Orchard, otherwise known as uh, Point Breeze. Growing up and all throughout our charter career, we, we really been known as a charter boat that really wants to just target salmon. Uh, we kind of put our boat in the right places during the time of year to capitalize on the best salmon bites. All right, so I've got a master's license from the Coast Guard. Our license allows us to take up to six paying passengers and that's it here. Typically we have parties of anywhere from three to six people when we're going on in charters. That's the limit. <laughs> so we offer a few different packages at Crazy Yankee Sport Fishing. Probably one of our most popular packages is what we call the Captain Special. And, and I like this package because it includes a four hour afternoon trip and then it's followed by a full day or an eight hour morning trip. And the nice thing about this is you've got two days booked. So if you've got some bad weather one day, you still have the next day to fish. The other great thing is for new parties. Typically the afternoon fishing is a little bit slower and it kind of ramps up as the afternoon goes on. Where the morning you're typically game on when you put the lures in the water and then it'll slow down as the sun comes up and the day gets long. So the nice thing about this is it gives you an opportunity to work with the new customers and on how to handle the rods and what to expect. This way when they show up the following morning, they've got a great idea and they know what they're expected to do and how to fight a fish. So that's one of the packages we sell a lot of is what we call the Captain Special. But as far as our trip durations, we do eight and six hour morning trips and then we do a four hour afternoon trips. So our typical charter schedule is we will fish an eight hour in the morning on Saturday, a four hour in the afternoon on Saturday. On Sunday, we'll do an eight hour in the morning or a six hour in the morning and we do about three trips a weekend. So what you can expect in May in Niagara County is lots of salmon. That's why we're here. This is where the most salmon are on the lake at one given time. Expect to go out and catch numerous king salmon. So we fish from a 1985 Trojan 10 meter express. And this boat was a boat that I remember being on as a kid with my father and I jumped in the back of this boat and I was just amazed at how big and how wide this boat was. And we had the opportunity to upgrade our boat. This is the boat we went looking for. The reason we went looking for this uh, is because it offers a huge platform that I can get six or eight people out of the elements with. Okay, we, underneath the canvas here, uh, Captain, mate, and up to six passengers can get out of the rain, out of the wind, and even out of the snow at times. We've been fishing in the snow. Uh, another great part about this boat is, is the back end. It gives you a lot of room for fishing. I mean, three, four fish hooked up at once, and people are standing side by side fighting fish, and no one's getting each other's way. So the platform is great for that. So we're sponsored by a few different companies, and I'll start off with some of the ones we've been with for a while. Cannon Downriggers has been with us for 13 or 14 years now. We expanded that to Humminbird. We started out with the Digitrol Downrigger when they first came out, and now we're onto the Optimums as far as Cannon's concerned. Great products. The great thing about Cannon and Humminbird is they work with each other. So they have this thing called the One Boat Network. So my Downriggers talk to my fish finders, my fish finders talk to my Downriggers, and I can get the data I need to be successful on the water. In the last few years, they've also partnered with Fishhawk, which is another one of our sponsors and they are now part of that one boat network. So on all of my downriggers, I've got my probe data that can help me be more efficient in the back of the boat and be more successful. I can also get that data on all my hummingbirds if I want to. So it may be redundant, but no matter where I'm in my boat, I've got the data and the information I need to be successful. Uh, Grizzly Coolers is another company that's been with us for a few years. You know, that's where we put all our our fish when we catch them. And we had a set of grizzlies on this boat for eight years and they look brand new still. You know, they're great coolers, they last. Another one of our companies that we work with is uh, McCoy Fishing Line. So it's a fishing line that I found when I was very young. It was very durable. I used it when I was 
doing a lot of my multi-species fishing when I was younger, chasing bass and pike and whatever other species, but we brought it to the trolling application and, and we've been very happy with it. Not many lines can, can take the abuse of finding a wire diver with an angry king on it and not break. And the McCoy fishing lines, we use the, the mean green, which is their copolymer, and we use their floral carbon. Uh, very good lines, very strong lines. Don't get many break offs, and if it does, it's, it's probably something we did wrong. So that's another great company that we work with. Uh, Daiwa Rods and Reels, great products there. Uh, another big sponsor that we work with a lot is Fish USA. They're a great company down in Pennsylvania. And if you're, if you're a fisherman, you've had to have heard them. And you, you, they sell tackle online and they have just about everything you need for the trolling game. Offshore Inline Planer Boards is another company that we joined with in the last few, few years. Atomic Manufacturing. They make uh, the flies, the meat rigs that we, that we run when we're fishing for salmon and trout. Their flies have won countless tournaments, have won countless derbies. I mean, they've got, they've probably won more money in the Great Lakes than any other fly company that's out there. And now with the new meat rigs and, and even his cut bait. So now they're into the cut bait game. So not only are they making meat rigs, but they also have cut bait to go with it. The other company that we work with a lot is Dreamweaver. And Dreamweaver is a great company out in Michigan with a great name in the trolling industry. Uh, they're great people that make a ton of lures for whatever whatever your game is whether you're walleye fishing salmon or trout fishing they have lures from spoons to divers to snubbers and whatever you need they have when it comes to trolling if you want to get a hold of us you can find us at www.crazyyankeesportfishing.com you can also hit me up on the cell 585-704-7996 we also are on all the major social media platforms. We've got a Facebook page, we've got a YouTube, we've got an Instagram, and those are the ones that we kind of keep up to date the most. We're very good about posting fishing reports and pictures. So after every single charter, the pictures and the fishing report go up on our website, as well as our Facebook page. So if you want to know what's going on in Lake Ontario, follow us on those different outlets and we'll keep you updated.